Well, CAR T-cell uh, therapy is uh, definitely quite exciting. Uh, and the emperor of all maladies in the recent uh, um, uh, NPR broadcast, uh, uh, prominent uh, placement, uh, uh, young patients with uh, relapsed, really refractory acute leukemia who appear to be cured using CAR T-cell therapy. However, in uh, solid tumors, particularly metastatic solid tumors, uh, are much more complex compared to uh, childhood leukemias. There are many different molecular abnormalities. Mutation burden is probably much higher. Simply put, we are uh, uh, freezing cells uh, from uh, the human, from the uh, individual with cancer, returning all the blood with the exception of T cells, which we in turn basically um, uh, grow in a, a media uh, of uh, antigen, uh, tumor-specific antigen, that enables these T cells to ultimately recognize uh, those antigens. And then we reinfuse the cells back into the uh, individual patient. So it's customized. It does take a bit of time. Uh, this is not immediate treatment. It takes four, six, eight weeks to actually expand the uh, um, population of T cells uh, to be reinfused. Presumably, once they're reinfused, they recognize these, T, uh, uh, these tumor antigens, uh, they've uh, developed a memory for these antigens, and they search out and destroy the uh, cells that are harboring those antigens, which hopefully are exclusive to the tumors. Um, sounds very simple, and in concept it is, but the human is an extraordinarily complex uh, uh, organism, and there are many different ways that this can go wrong. Uh, so far, at least uh, the preliminary studies in adult solid tumor we have not seen the benefits that we've observed in uh, childhood leukemia. Certainly we're hopeful and maybe over time with further refinements we will, but this is not yet ready for prime time. It is still a, an investigational phase one approach. Uh, if I were to put the individual on a study evaluating CAR T cells, I would make sure they're in tip-top shape, highly motivated, and also that they've pretty much exhausted uh, standard uh, therapeutic options.